This is every US state's official Smash Brothers character, based on their traits from their original games as well as their movesets in Smash. Where does your main fall, and which character do you think best represents where you live? Leave your take down in the comments and let's get started. Alabama. Shulk. If you want to blend in with Alabamians, Alabamans, people from Alabama, you gotta be comfortable shirtless, and I'd say this guy is. Also, everyone down there loves the Crimson Tide, and his sword is almost the exact same shade of red. Alaska. Ice climbers. They're both wearing parkas and live somewhere freezing cold with lots of ice, snow, and polar bears. That sounds like Alaska to me. Arizona. Pit, meaning large hole in the ground. Grand Canyon. Arkansas. Duck hunt. Apparently, Stuttgart, Arkansas is considered the duck hunting capital of the world, so at least the dog would like it down there. California. Banjo-Kazooie. There's a big old brown bear on the state flag, and I guess they used to be pretty populous there, so we're rolling with it. Colorado. We Fit Trainer. Known for being overly obsessed with staying in shape and making fun of fat people. <laughs> so, the We Fit Trainer would fit in flawlessly in the state with the lowest obesity rate in the nation. Connecticut. Pyra Mithra. From 1701 to 1874, Connecticut had two capitals, New Haven and Hartford, and it's the only state to ever do that. So the only character in the game that lets you play as two different characters at once is a great choice. I know you're about to comment something, but no, Pokemon Trainer has three and the Ice Climbers just mirror each other, that doesn't count. Delaware, Mr. Game & Watch. Delaware is the oldest US state, and Mr. Game & Watch is the oldest character in the game. Not in terms of his canon age, but just how long the character himself has been around. Florida, King K. Rule. I really wanted to give him to Louisiana, since the state has nearly twice as many alligators, but K. Rule is a crocodile, and those only really inhabit southern Florida. Georgia, Peach. I mean, do I need to say anything else? Hawaii, Incineroar. He's a starter Pokemon in Sun and Moon, which takes place in the Alola region. Obviously just a Hawaii spoof. Idaho, Falco. The state raptor is the Falco Peregrinus. It's not blue, but the state bird, the mountain bluebird, is almost the exact same shade as Falco, so the two combined are perfect for him. Illinois, Morton. Illinois is the largest producer of pumpkins in the United States, and that's mostly thanks to the pumpkin capital of the world being in Morton, Illinois. Indiana, Captain Falcon. Indianapolis is best known for their motor speedway and hosting the Indy 500, so the best character for this one would have to be the only one from an exclusively racing series. A dead series, but still. Iowa, Dark Pit. Iowans are known as Hawkeyes, and the superhero Hawkeye is known for being an expert archer, just like Pit. And since Hawkeye's color scheme is a little bit darker, I figured Dark Pit works better. Kansas, Zero Suit Samus. She looks eerily similar to Taylor Swift, that chick that went to all the Kansas City Chiefs football games. Um, actually, Kansas City, Missouri is where the Chiefs play. I don't care. Fine, the state motto to the stars through difficulty applies to her since she explores the stars and has been through some serious sh**. You happy now? Kentucky, Young Link. You ever wonder why those chickens get pissed at him so quickly? Probably because they've seen him cook their friends. Kentucky is the holy land when it comes to fried chicken, and I have evidence to believe it's this guy's fault. No, I don't. Louisiana, Bowser Jr., for two reasons. One, he's a turtle, and thanks to all the swamps and bayous down there, it's a pretty decent climate for him. And two, New Orleans is the father of jazz music, and some of his themes are jazzy as f Maine, Villager. It's the most rural state in America, and since Animal Crossing is all about living in a small town with a tightly knit community of friendly neighbors, I like this pick. Marilyn, Zelda. Marilyn was named after Queen Henrietta Maria, and of all the female royalty in this game, Zelda is undoubtedly the most deserving of having a state named after her. Also, the official state sport for Marilyn is jousting, and the knight dude she builds with her down special looks an awful lot like it's wearing traditional jousting gear. Massachusetts, Bayonetta. According to the lore, she's a witch, and Salem, Massachusetts is famous for the witch trials, so she probably wouldn't like it there, but it fits. Michigan, Wolf. It's often referred to as the Wolverine State, so it's kind of self-explanatory. Honorable mention goes to Rob, though. Apparently Michigan's home to the most robots in the country. Okay, I'm gonna stay over here, you keep them shits over there, and we'll be all good. Minnesota! Isabel. Minnesota's generally considered the friendliest state, so who else but Isabel to represent that? Mississippi. Pichu. The lowest life expectancy in the game and the shortest in the country. A truly remarkable pair. Missouri. Kirby. Right behind Rome, Kansas City, Missouri has the second most water fountains in the world. And I don't mean the drinking ones, I mean the full-on decorative ones. So since the Fountain of Dreams is a big part of the Kirby series, at least in Smash Bros, I like it. 
Montana, Sonic the Hedgehog. This one would have been a lot harder if it weren't for the Sonic movie, because in that, he lives in Green Hills, Montana. Clean. Nebraska, Corin. It's just fields and fields and fields of corn. Corn. Nevada, Joker. Las Vegas is where people go to play cards, and Joker is a card. New Hampshire, Pac-Man. The largest arcade not only in the country, but in the world is the fun spot in Weirs Beach, New Hampshire. Pac-Man is the symbol of arcade gaming, so I think it works well. Also, I was wrong. I guess there is shit to do in New Hampshire. New Jersey, Luigi. I know he's from New York just like Mario, but each state only gets one. And since Jersey is basically the other brother when compared to New York, I think it fits. Also, the nickname The Garden State is better suited for Luigi's green color scheme. New Mexico, Link. This version of Link is based on his appearance in Breath of the Wild, and the world in that game shares a striking resemblance to the geography of New Mexico. With vast mountainscapes, valleys, wooded forests, and the white sand deserts, it has a little bit of everything and would be the perfect fit for an open world game. New York, Mario. It's a predictable choice, but I mean, where else am I supposed to put him? The man's from Brooklyn, and New Donk City is New York City. North Carolina, Piranha Plant. It's no secret these things were based on the Venus flytrap, and those are mostly native to the swampy regions of North Carolina. North Dakota, Toon Link. The geographical center of North America lies somewhere in North Dakota. There's some controversy over whether it's in Rugby, Robinson, or funnily enough, the town of Center, but the exact point is unclear. It is somewhere in North Dakota though, and the geographic center of the Smash roster is Toon Link. Ohio, Donkey Kong. Rest in peace, Harambe. Oklahoma, Meta Knight. This state has more tornadoes per square mile than any other place in the world, and Meta Knight's infamous for his tornado attack, so maybe he's causing all of it. Oregon, Pokemon Trainer. According to some website that kept popping up when I was looking for something for Oregon, the state was ranked number one most interested in Pokemon Go prior to its release. So I guess everyone there wants to be a real Pokemon Trainer. But if that's not good enough for you, Oregon was the 33rd state of the union, and wouldn't you know, so is the Pokemon Trainer. You can't make this shit up. Pennsylvania, Little Mac. This dude's series was heavily inspired by the Rocky film series, and those movies take place in Philadelphia, PA. Rhode Island, Yoshi. He's from an island, and this state is the only one with island in the name. It's lazy, but it f***ing works, leave me alone. South Carolina, Sora. South Carolina was the first state to secede from the Union in the Civil War, and the first character I'd make secede from this game is Sora. There's definitely worse characters, but the amount of hate comments I got for posting a character prediction video and saying Sora shouldn't be added makes me do this out of pure spite. South Dakota, Wario. The state's not known for a bad smell or producing the most garlic or anything. Rather, they host the largest motorcycle rally in the world in Sturgis, and that's probably your best bet at bumping into Wario. Though, I don't know why you'd want to. Tennessee, Diddy Kong. This dude lives in a treehouse with his pal Donkey Kong, and the tallest one in the world stood in Crossville, Tennessee, until 2019 when it burned to the ground. Texas, Snake. Texas has the highest number of registered weapons in the US, and is one of the more lenient states when it comes to what you can own and where you can bring it. So Snake and his vast arsenal of different grenades, missiles, and guns is the perfect fit. Utah, Rosalina and Luma. This state is known for having the most incredible stargazing spots on the globe, and knowing Rosalina, that's exactly where she'd want to be. Vermont, Mewtwo. 45% of households in the state own a cat. That's the highest in the country, and it sounds depressing as hell. Virginia, Ness. For those that don't know, he's from the game Earthbound, and that takes place in Eagle Land, which is in itself a parody of the US, but it's also the second entry in the Mother series, and Virginia is known as the Mother of States. Washington, Bowser. Nintendo of America's headquarters is in Redmond, Washington, and the current president COO of Nintendo of America is Doug Bowser. West Virginia, Lucas. Same reason I gave for Ness, except Lucas. Wisconsin, Greninja. You ready for this? The largest water park in America is in where else but f***ing cheese land. And of course Greninja because water frogman. Wyoming, Steve from Minecraft. The game all about building with blocks ought to take place in the most square shaped state in the country, right? No? Well, I tried, and that's all of them. So comment down below letting me know what character best represents where you live, and if you have another idea for one of these types of videos, please comment down below. We're posting Mario content on this channel every Saturday at 12 p.m. Eastern, so if you never want to miss another video, please Super Smash Bros. Or just click the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss another one. And in the meantime, if you want something more to watch, check out this video, where I give each U.S. state an official Mario Kart 8 Deluxe track.
Thank you so much for watching, and please have a fantastic rest of your day. I'll see you next week.